Here's your Storm Track 7 forecast. Good afternoon. I'm Storm Track 7 meteorologist Brandon Libby. We started off with thick fog once again. That is starting to lift, but it's going to be much of the same. Plenty of cloud cover, not just today, but for tomorrow, heading into the weekend, and that fog will continue at times, especially throughout the overnight hours. As far as future track goes, uh, you're not going to see much here. The cloud cover continues, but we're staying dry, not even much in the way of flurries, so uh, just kind of some boring weather out there, if you will. That cloud cover continues through the overnight hours and will stay mostly cloudy heading into your Friday and even all the way through the weekend. We are talking plenty of clouds, so not much of a pattern change here. And that means that we'll continue to see periods of fog, even some light fog and haze lingering out there throughout today, but it shouldn't be overall too thick. And for tonight, we could see those visibilities dipping down once again to about a mile or less at times. I don't think we're going to see as dense of fog. We probably won't see as many dense fog advisories, but still some fog could make for a slower commute heading into Friday morning. And uh, for Friday, we could be also talking a few areas of lingering fog, much like what we've seen today in the past couple of days. So for today, temperatures at least will be fairly mild. We'll be in the low 30s, mostly cloudy skies. Northeast wind 5 to 10 miles per hour and for tonight again mostly cloudy areas of fog with a light north northeast wind and low temperatures down to the low and mid 20s. As far as city by city forecast goes, we'll have a slow decline in temperatures throughout Friday and into the weekend. Friday we're looking at the upper 20s to low 30s and then Saturday probably about the mid 20s and that's where we should stay for Sunday as well. Our best chance for any sunshine will come from Monday through Wednesday with partly sunny skies. That still means more clouds and sunshine, so it's not going to be an abundant amount of sun, but maybe something. Temperatures will slowly warm their way back up to the mid-30s by the middle of next week, that being Thursday with a chance for some snow. Then the winds will kick in and things look to cool down pretty quickly by the end of the 10-day forecast, a high of 22 for Saturday.